Okay, so what are we working on today? We're going to be talking about how to find undefined values in fractions. Now, we're going to do two questions. Now, if we're trying to find an undefined value, we got to figure out for both of these questions when our denominator is going to equal zero. So we got two examples here. For the first one, we got a trinomial. The second one, we got a binomial. First one has an x squared in it, so we're going to look at the first one. Now, in this case, for this value, we got to think of our factors for 6, so we got 1 and 6, 2 and 3. Now, in this case, because this is going to be a negative 1, we'll set up our two sets of parentheses. We get x and x. I have to get negative 1. The only way we can do that is with the second pair, so we have to get negative 3 and positive 2. Now that means x would have to be the opposites, which would be 3 or negative 2. Now it says in the question, the negative values. So in this case, our answer would end up being a negative 2. Now for the second one, we only have 2n minus 1. We have to set that equal to 0. So in this case, we're going to have a fraction for an answer. And we're going to solve this just like a regular equation. So I'm going to start by adding 1 on both sides to eliminate the negative 1. Then we have 2n equals 1. Then we're going to finish off by dividing by 2. And in this case, n is going to be 1 half. So this value, this fraction, is going to be undefined when n here equals 1 half. So if you got any more questions, try to stop in. See if there's anything I can help you with. I uh, would hope this helps and uh, get our homework in tomorrow.